Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. These are my thoughts and opinions. Today I want to talk about an issue that's affecting millions of people across the country, rising rent prices. As we all know, the cost of living seems to be going up and up. But one thing that is hitting us particularly hard is the increasing cost of rent. From coast to coast, people are feeling the squeeze and it's getting harder and harder to make ends meet. The truth is, rent prices are outpacing wages, and it's creating a crisis. We're seeing families and individuals being priced out of their own neighborhoods, forced to choose between paying rent or putting food on the table. It's unsustainable and it's unacceptable. We need to ask ourselves, what's driving these price hikes and what can we do to stop them? So in this video, I'll be exploring the causes and consequences of rising rent prices and what we can do to fight back. Whether you're a renter, homeowner, or just someone who cares about affordable housing, this issue affects all of us. Let's dive in and explore what we can do to make housing more affordable for everyone. So what's driving these price hikes? Well, one factor is gentrification. As wealthier people move into previously affordable neighborhoods, landlords see an opportunity to cash in and raise rents. It's a classic case of supply and demand, but one that's pushing out longtime residents and small businesses. Another factor is the lack of affordable housing options. We're simply not building enough affordable units to keep up with the, the demand. And with more people renting than ever before, the competition for those units is fierce. And let's not forget about corporate landlords. Big companies are buying up properties left and right, raising rents and pushing out small independent landlords. It's a trend that's only exacerbating the problem. But what are the consequences of these rising prices? For one, it's forcing people to make impossible choices between paying rent and paying for necessities like food, healthcare, and transportation. It's leading to increased homelessness, increased stress, and decreased quality of life. So what can we do to fight back? First, we need to increase funding for affordable housing programs. We need to incentivize developers to build more affordable units, and we need to provide support for those who are struggling to pay rent. Second, we need to strengthen tenant protections. We need to implement rent control measures and we need to make it harder for corporate landlords to push out small, independent landlords. And finally, we need to hold our elected officials accountable. We need to demand them that they take action on the issue and we need to support candidates who make affordable housing a priority. In conclusion, the rising cost of rent is a crisis that affects us all. It's a crisis of affordability, of accessibility, and of humanity. But it's not a lost cause. If we work together, if we demand change, and if we support each other, we can make a difference. We can create a world where everyone has access to safe, affordable housing. Let's make it happen.